Good morning everybody, it's Kate. I'm here to show you a quick tutorial for, you know, um, it's one eyeshadow I did with L'Oreal's suggestions. You can plug in, they have the website where you can do, um, I forget what it was called, but you can color, like scheme your yourself. You can do um, edgy, calm, whatever. So this is the colors that they recommended and the blush I improvised and so didn't the liner because I didn't have the products that they recommended. but something very similar so I hope you enjoy and the end of the video I'm gonna put an outtake of me doing my hair because the tutorial has my hair wet so have a great day and I hope you subscribe and I'll see you guys it's Kate I'm gonna do just a look that I was fooling around with on um, I was on L'Oreal's website the other day um, just to see like what they would color match me for kind of an eye look so I'm going in with this um, 24 hour in amber rush and they had, you know, obviously used their product, but I don't have that. So I'm using the Krylon Hurricane Gray by Rimmel. It's this, um, just a pencil. Here's a cap. But I felt no need. Okay. And I've used the base as this Almay, um, cover. I actually already put the base on. I'm just gonna put a little bit more on. I put it on because I, um, I wasn't sure which eye I was gonna try and show you. So there's the finished look. I went in with, um, well, you'll see, but. Now I'm happy with it. Okay, so it's very easy. So it's one color. So I'm going to go in with this. This is a Crown C422 Crescent Shadow. Just go into the pigment and then just, it's, it's like a pigment, and then just pack it in. This is the only color I use. Um, And then I just take this, this is a Soho brush, I got it from Walgreens, it's, it was on clearance, I got it for like a dollar or something. And then I'm just going to blend it out so my crease isn't, because um, I'm not wearing any other color on my crease. I'm use this one. They um, suggested a blush, a blush, 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 that I don't already, that I don't have, so I was going to pick it up and then I decided not to, because um, you know I'm on a no buy. And I've been doing really, really well. I decided I'm... I'm not purchasing anything oops, until I run out of something. <laughs> you get that. Something. Just one thing. However, I did run out of my uh, nail polish top coat that I used. I used the INM. But I have like four backups, so. Alright, so do they look the same? A little bit. And then I just went under a little bit. I did the under after I did my mascara, but you know, whatever. You do whatever you want. So I first go in with this CoverGirl Lash Blash. Um, I have the. The one that, um, it was, I got it from Big Lots for $1.50. It was the one that they had tried to do different, um, caps. And I love purple, so I picked up the purple one. And this stuff is like 6 or $7 now for $1.50. I don't care what color the cap is. So for blush, they had suggested using, um... It's a true match blush. I don't have any of them. They're mineralized blushes um, in, I think it's warm honey. So I am going to use, I thought I kind of had one that was like, uh, anyway, yeah. I'm gonna use this one. Oh, bear honey. So I guess close enough. It's a true match blush in bear honey. And then um, I use Dallas as a bronzer contour. So I'm just gonna go in with this and put that on my cheeks. I think it looks nice, so maybe I won't buy the other one to finish my under eyes because I was getting a ton of fallout. So I'm going with the Olay corrector. I was getting a ton of fallout and it was just annoying that uh, I would 
would have to redo my eye makeup. This is a crown brush. And I'm not... My cousin's girlfriend came over. Hello, Kristen. Um, she's adorable. We were talking about Sigma brushes. And I was like, go buy crown. But she's cute. I really like her. Stick around, girlfriend. Uh, this eye. So, yeah. So I think this is an awesome look for spring, um, especially if you have red, red hair. I tried to look up different looks, and I could only get so far, of course, but, you know, because the, uh, the system was giving me a hard time, so there's that. I think I might go over the top with a, hmm, a gray shadow, so I have MAC. Just readily available. So I'm gonna go in with Max. I don't know what color this is. I think it's slate. Scene. Wasn't even close. Alright, so I'm just gonna kinda tap that in to set. What uh oh. It's Thursday, people. One more day to Friday. Giselle and I are having a sleepover. Because Robbie's working on Saturday, so we're having a sleepover. And she's been particularly in rare form. Holy hell, it's like Godzilla City at night for her. Whew. Suggestions, comments, leave them below because I got no idea. Anyway, so Kristen and I were talking about Ardell lashes. Um, that it, we bonded over makeup. Um, and I might try... I never cared about the fact that I'm missing an eyelash. <laughs> Doesn't bother me. Um, so we were talking about the Ardell lashes and she said she had used the individual lashes and they stayed on forever. So I might try it. I don't know. So there's my finished look. <laughs> and I'm choosing not to do my eyebrows because I think I'm going to go get them waxed today. I'm not sure. But I think so because I need to get them cleaned up. I'm trying to grow them in here. It's not really working. So thanks for watching. I hope you subscribe and I will see you soon. Oh, and my lip gloss I'm wearing... Knockout Pearl by Nibbling. So, have a great day.